My beloved audience around the globe, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuhu. Today, inshallah, I'll be giving a presentation in regards to the importance of Ramadan and the importance of the mosque. But first of all, let's look into the importance of Ramadan. What's the importance of Ramadan? To answer that question, I will go into the Holy Quran, where Allah states, Inna allazina amanu wa amilus salihati ula'ika hum khairul bariya. Verily, those who believe and do good works, they are the best of the creatures. This is exactly what Ramadan helped us to accomplish, to help us to be among khairul bariya, the best of the creatures, by establishing spiritual reflection, self-improvement, devotion to Allah, self-discipline, spiritual awareness, gratitude, and empathy. Also, there are two ways for man to communicate with God. The first is to allow God to speak to you and listen. The second is for you to speak to God. But how do, you, how do God speak to you? In order for God to speak to you, you must read Quran. All the message in the Quran is the word of Allah. By reading them, it's like Allah is speaking to you. And for you to speak to God, how do you speak to God? In order for you to speak to God, you must offer your five daily prayers, not just mere offering, but to offer it with complete dedication and devotion. And we all know that when Ramadan arrives, people level of reading Quran and offering Salat increases. As that increases, our communication with God also increases. As our communication with God increases, that's when our spiritual connection with God is built. And that's the whole point of our existence. Therefore, Ramadan plays a vital part in a believer's life. Fasting during the month of Ramadan is an important act of worship that teaches man to recognize and fulfill Hakukullah and Hakukul Ibad. The duty we owe to Allah and the duty we owe to humanity. It is a time to strengthen familial and community ties and to seek forgiveness for one's sins. Fasting may also provide several health benefits, including weight loss, blood sugar control, and protection against medical conditions like cancer and neurodegenerative disorders. Therefore, Ramadan is very important because it is a practice that dates back centuries. Now we continue to the importance of the mosque. As we all know, mosque, is the house of Allah, the king and the maker of the universe. Therefore, there is no building or a house in this world more important compared to the mosque because there is no building or a house that establishes love, unity, and connection between people and their creator than a mosque. And God states in the Holy Quran, وَأْتَسِمُوا بِحَبْلِ اللَّهِ جَمِعَا وَلَا تَفَرَّقُوا and hold fast all together by the rope of Allah and be not divided. This is exactly what mosques help people to accomplish, to come together as one family, as one people, one community, men, women, old and young, the poor and the rich, where the prayer is led by an imam whom everyone follows in worshiping one God. Mosque is a place of spiritual development since all activities in the mosque are for Allah's pleasure. It provides all facilities for spiritual advancement, activities, and serves as a center for education, communication, and information. When we look into the Holy Quran, the first, Quranic, uh, the first chapter, Surah Al-Fatiha, it says, Thee alone do we worship, and thee alone do we implore for help. Guide us in the right path. In both these verses, plural form is used being clear that it is being recited by a congregation and not a single person. Therefore, people should try their utmost best to offer their obligatory prayers at the mosque, and mosque should not be built for mere building or decoration, but rather its main objective. It is through the establishment of the five daily prayers in the mosque that the Holy Prophet Muhammad sallam, established worship of one God around the globe. 24 hours a day and seven days a week. This is an accomplishment that no other prophet has been able to do.